This afternoon we went to Regency Court and we met up with a group of pupils who were going in to actually do some work in their garden. So they've had a Dementia Friends session to raise their awareness of, of what dementia actually means. And now they're going in on a, a weekly basis during school time and they're making some real progress within the garden. And actually, what I found out recently is that this piece of work is actually going to go to them kids' VTEC qualification. So it's just fabulous, really. I think it, that really is a, a piece of the project that's using the care home as an asset. It's an, an asset that the community, that that school has got, that they can use within the curriculum for their kids. So it's just a win-win, really. It's really positive. Uh... Some weeks ago, I was introduced to Regency Court and I brought some of the students over here to, uh, to meet people who were, who were living with dementia. Uh, the students themselves sat down uh, with the practitioners and uh, were given introduction and given education in regards to uh, people who are living with dementia. And that led on to the students themselves looking at the grounds around the area with a view to developing it, which would be better for the residents to sit out there in the summer and enjoy the atmosphere. We um, started off by getting rid of like all the branches, all the debris and stuff. corner and debris and stuff. And then um, after we'd moved all that, we uh, decided to plant some trees all around the e edges of the area. So that means it make it look fancy then? Yes, yeah, so it makes all it fancier. So we started by digging holes and putting them bamboo sticks in with the covers over them. So and then replace it with back with the mud. Yeah, and then um, planting obviously like little trees and stuff. Well, when I came one afternoon, my husband said, John said, oh, we've had some children in this afternoon. And I thought he meant the little ones, but when I asked Vicky, she said that it'd been the school, you know, the children that were doing the work in here. Oh, it's absolutely brilliant because at one time people didn't care home, so we just left. They'd only see the care staff and the ones that had visitors. But it's brilliant now that they're all coming in. Well, we, we, we came down here initially uh, from both sides of the coin, I would say. The students and the residents were a little bit shy. Uh, the initial point was to build up a communication between both parties, and that's developed all, uh, into what we have now, where the residents are talking to the students, the students are engaging with the residents, and we've got a com communication uh, uh, network going. It's, a, it's a, an eye-opener, I think, especially for younger people, because a lot of them have grandparents that suffer with Alzheimer's, and I don't think they understand the implications of it so we've had a lot to do with them through school as well where they've come in and done an assembly and I think that had a big impact on them when they heard the stories of like um, you know people when they go and make cups of coffee they can't remember how to make coffee anymore and I think that touched a lot of students as well yeah definitely like raised the awareness within at the car I knew a little bit but yeah I knew a little bit well, not as much as when we came in I thought we were going to be boring with them when I first started coming I think it's a greater understanding of what people learn to live with. I think um, it's become a lot more selfless, like they want to help, um, they want to work hard and they want to create this for them. And they build, they build good relationships with the people they work with as well and they see them and they want to help them. So I think it's been fantastic for them. Yeah, like they look forward to every Thursday coming out here and helping out. The legacy is to continue uh, and to enlarge on the project. There's, there's more than Regency Court in this area. If we can move out and expand on the project itself, uh, either it be with school or other uh, youth groups, crack on, get involved and uh, let's see what it goes from there. Um, I think it's a fantastic project. I think um, it's a big learning curve for everyone and it just allows the kids to have a lot of fun. So I'd encourage anyone to take part in it. I'd agree get involved, it's worthwhile and it's extremely rewarding.